let's look at editing a take folder. Let's use the take folder from the previous video. To enter editing mode, click on the little squares up here and it will change into the scissors. In this mode, you can edit a region start or ending point, so you can simply just go to the bottom left corner, hold and drag to resize it. And then I can also edit the active comp to create new take folders. Now we haven't looked at the editing tools yet, but you can access them from up here. So as my secondary tool, I'm going to use the scissors. And I'm going to cut on the active comp. Let's do two cuts here, and as you can see, it creates new take folders. And I can I can work on them individually. So I can just you know close them or come here and select sec another take. I can do whatever we want I want. So let's command Z to go back. Okay. Now I can also edit the regions within the take folder. So let's cut here and here. I can just in any of the takes. I can resize them as before. I can grab them, I can move them, and I can actually move them to another take. So I'm going to take take 2.1 and move it up here, or then simply move that one down here. So I can do whatever I want. Let's command Z and go back. And let's switch to quick swipe for a minute. I want to show you something else. Okay. Now if I right click on that one, I can use slice at comp sections and it will slice all of your regions at the comp borders. So I can do that. Let's go back to editing and now I can grab this one and move it as before or do whatever I want. Or the option underneath that are trim to active comp sections. That will keep the active parts of my take and it will delete everything else. Let's command Z to go back. And lastly, I want to show you something. So when you cycle record, you get all of your takes, take one, two, three, and so on. Now, all of these takes are a continuous take. So if I extend, so let's go to editing mode. If I extend this one, and then go back to take one, and I can just extend it, let's zoom out a bit all the way here. So that's four bars. If you remember, every four bars we cycled to the beginning and we got a new take. So these down here are its take. So that's take one. Let's use the cycle bar. Uh, shift command and dot to move forward. So that's the second take, the third take and the fourth take all in one continuous take in case you want to use it.